In these problems, we're working with scientific notation with negative exponents. When you have scientific notation with a positive exponent, you just move the decimal point to the right as many places as the power is. When you have scientific notation with a negative exponent, and you want to put it back into standard notation, you simply do the opposite. You move the decimal point to the left, that number of spaces. So I'm going to move it 2 to the left. So 1 and 2, and my decimal point will go here. And then I fill in with zeros. So this is 0 0.023. Let's try this problem where we have to go the opposite direction. So here we have a number in standard notation, and we want to write it in scientific notation. Well, we're going to go ahead and move the decimal point until we get a number between 1 and 10. So in this case, it's going to be 3.545. We want our decimal point to end up there. So let's count how many spaces we have to move it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I can write this as... 3.545 times 10 to the negative fifth. So that's a little bit of work with scientific notation with negative exponents.